And now the House of Representatives has called on the Central Bank of Nigeria to increase the availability of the new note of 200 naira, 500 naira and 1,000 naira note respectively and gradually withdraw of the old note. Honorable Victor Ogene highlighted the difficulty caused by the year 2023 currency change including scarcity of new notes and legal issues. He criticized the CBN for not preparing Nigerians for the transition. Concerned that Due to inadequate funding by federal government, public institutions are unable to operate optimally. Thus, the recent hike in exclusive tariffs and the consequent power cut for defaulting institutions has thrown them into total darkness, putting the the at risk and, and security of students and staff in jeopardy. Also concerned that the attended riots by students due to inability to use important learning equipment resulted in the closure of those of the affected institutions. I worried that grounding of academic activities in Nigeria could lead to incessant frustrations among students and potentially have severe socio-economic consequences. The House of Representatives has established an adult community to investigate employment process at the Federal Inland Revenue Service Corporate Affairs Commission and the Nigerian Deposit Insurance Corporation. The committee aims to assess compliance with the 1999 Constitution and report back within four weeks. Concern that if this allegation of lopsided employment and extra budgetary expenditure are true, the principles of fairness, equity, and transparency are violated. Are violated, eroded public trust in critical institutions, reduce operational efficiency, and will foster a sense of marginalization and hopelessness among sections of Nigeria populace. Worried that the alleged malpractice could undermine the capacity of the Federal Inland Revenue Services, the Corporate Affairs Commission, and Nigerian Deposit Insurance Corporations (NDIC) to e effectively carry out their mandate, resulting in inefficiency that may affect tax collections corporate regulation as the stability of Nigerian financial system. The House has also called on the federal government to halt building and disconnection of public tertiary institutions under the current tariff system. Concerned that the Central Bank of Nigeria has not shown any sign of sensitization or kick-started any awareness program to remind Nigerians about this important economic policy in order to make them prepare for the deadline of December 31st, 2024. Worried that Nigerians will be plunged into more chaotic situations than what happened in February 2023 when the old 200, 500, and 1,000 Naira notes shall cease, cease to be legal tender and medium of first change for goods and services as from January 1, 2025. Disturbed that the CBN ought to have started public awareness, such as jingles, television and radio announcements, social media postings, flyers, daily newspapers, and periodic magazine publications, three months before the deadline. But now, with about two months to the deadline, there is nothing to show that the APES Bank is prepared for the exercise. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.